A total of $1,200 is deposited into savings account for one year, part at 5% and the remainder at 7%. If 72 was earned in interest, how much was deposited at 5%? So this is an investment question related to simple interest for one year. The formula for simple interest is uh, interest equals principal times the interest rate percent. So this is how you calculate the interest at the end of every year for your simple interest account. Uh, so for this question, we're going to use this formula to calculate. And apparently we have two of them. So I'm going to create a table uh, to summarize the information. All right, the first account is the 5% account, right? 5% account. Apparently the interest rate will be 5%. So let's put 5% below percent. And the other account is the 7% account. Let's put 7% under the percent. The total is $1,200. So let's also add a row for total. Let's add a row for total. Uh, the total principal is 1200 so 1200 goes under principal in the row of total and the total interest is 72 so 72 put uh, in the row of total under interest if 72 was earned in interest how much was deposited at five percent so let's assume that x amount is deposited at five percent so i'm going to put x uh, in the row 5% under principal, that's how much you invested in that 5% account. And because the total is 1,200, so you would know that uh, 1,200 minus X amount is deposited at 7% account. So you put that right there. Uh, and then we could use the formula to calculate the interest. So for the 5% account, you're going to do X times 5%. Right, to calculate the interest. So that is 0.05x. I'm going to convert it to decimals. And then the second account, 7%, you do the same thing. 1200 minus x times 7%. Uh, if I simplify this, I'm going to get 84 minus 0.07x. And now we get two expressions, this expression and this expression. These two expressions are the interest from two accounts. Since the total is 72, so we could create an equation based on the first column that we have right here. So 0.05x plus 84 minus 0.07x. This is the total interest, which is $72. So this is our equation. Let's simplify the left-hand side. If I combine like terms, I will get 84 minus 0.02x equals 72. Subtract 84 from both sides. I will get negative 0.02x equals negative 12. And then we divide both sides by coefficient negative 0.02. we obtain that x is 600. And that's exactly what we need to find. Because it's 600, that means also 600 is deposit at the other account because the total is $1,200. But we only need to find out one of them. So you just answer uh, $600 was deposited at 5%. And that's your final answer.